Right, so I'll give you a little backstory for this one. So there's a car show in London called the Salon Prière, if it's called, and there's millions and millions of pounds worth of cars there, really high-end car show, but the tickets are 50 quid, and I was like, I can't really spend 50 quid plus train tickets right now when I'm not getting that much work in. I was like, I just, I'm gonna leave it. But then there's another company that was going called Collecting Cars, and they were running a competition for two, three tickets. And I was like, okay. I might as well enter, even though I never win online stuff, ever. Never win competitions online. I was at the gym, I got a message, you have won, congratulations, you have won two tickets, send us your email and we'll send you the tickets over. And I was like, fucking sick. So I was like, I have to go now because I've won two tickets. So I asked my mate if he wanted to come with the second ticket. He said yes, we jumped on the train and I'll let the rest roll. That sinks the audio <laughs> for editing. Let's have a look, shall we? Start here? Yes, indeed. <laughs> God, this is mad. God, we should have just wore suits just to take the piss. <laughs> God, that looks so nice in black. Jesus. It's one of them ones where you like try to find a clear spot for like people not being in the way. Oh, there it is, there it is, there it is. God, it's so like, imagine detailing one of them. You'd have a fucking field day. But that's the thing, yeah, you could go to events like when you build up and be like, yeah, I actually do this. Like, you want to pop around? Because they'll be like, oh, because when you get started, they'll be like, oh, cheap rates, yeah, nice. <laughs> You're like, right now, well, especially if you, well, you know the value of the equipment. Well, yeah, that's it. And you know what people are charging. Because I'm assuming you've looked what other people are charging. Yeah. What is it? I think, what, like, just an interior one about 80 quid, Oh, so you can do machine parts on the outside. Yeah. I guess it's not too bad. Like I said to you, it's just getting that right customer that wants to spend that money. Yeah, well that's just where you have to just make sure you go to the right people. Like the amount of people I've gone to that are not the right people, like a local calf, yeah. not one going to pay 200 for a photo shoot. You have to change who you're reaching out to. Oh, the yellow. I've seen this cut. This was hit at a car meet yesterday with the carbon. Forge carbon. Yeah, it's really nice. It just looks different. I might try to get shot through the fence maybe. It looks sick. Oh, smell. Like, you just 
just like, when you stand near it, you can just like feel the fucking power. I bet that's scary to drive. That's mad. Hennessy. Yeah. That's what it is. No, have you not seen the one that looks like a lotus, like the yellow one? It's in a lot of video, it's a lot of racing games. With the iPhone, are you better off zooming in or just 1%? I think zooming in. Yeah, like. What makes it better? Zooming in makes it better. Like, not loads, but like just so enough. Obviously, doing 0.5. If you're doing 0.5, then you want to get like right up close, yeah. like right above it or like right near the headlight. But if you're gonna do like shots like that, yeah, definitely like zoom in slightly. Yeah, but I do like the iPhone for the wide shots because it looks really cool, especially if you like stand right over the front of the bonnet and get yeah. a nice top down. Yeah. It looks so sick. I have to buy presets. Oh yeah. <laughs> Some people brought them. Did they? Yeah, I've made like 40 quid. Oh, Two more people brought them, yeah. So I got like 40 quid so far off them. And that's just one of the things that the more my audience grows, the more that'll sort of generate. Got feedback from it? Yeah, they like it. The guy that yeah. I message and that does photography as well, he really likes them. He's like, yeah, they're decent. It's a, it's a lot harder for the iPhone users because they have to so much process to get them onto the actual thing. Yeah. Like, it's a lot more, whereas on the computer, you just drag the file, drop it, yeah. go straight into the software. Yeah. Whereas on the phone, it's a little bit more tricky, but yeah, they seem to be working because I use them every day. That's the thing. Yeah. So I knew they were going to work because I use them every day. So um, it's just the way I make my photos look the way they do. You darken the background. Mm. Yeah, just make the colour, set it as it is, and then all they have to do is really change how bright or dark it is. And all the rest is done. Oh, that'd be sick if they had that open. Jesus, man. No, I think it's different. That's your last though. You've got the front end, and then you've got a massive sensor for it. Is that what that is? Yeah. Do you reckon it now flips? Maybe it flips in. No, it probably doesn't. Is that fake bird noises? I think it is. Oh, that front end is so sick. It's cool that the fences, because you can actually like shoot through the fences. It's really nice to get like them blurry either side and then you get the nice front end of the car. So sick. See, with that camera, you can have the car in focus, but the... Yeah, so like I can lock the focus there, yeah. and then when I put it there, that fence is blurry in front yeah, of it. Good that, yeah. yeah, you should be able to. If you tap the tap that, yeah, and if you've got to put it into this mode, portrait, that's more of like a that's going to make it even more, yeah. Just trying to lock it on because portrait mode does like. Um, like if you point it towards my camera, you'll see it like makes the camera, like point your phone towards that in portrait mode, it like makes that in focus and it should make the rest of it blurry oh. if you're far enough away. Cause it's for like headshots. Oh. Oh, yeah. So like if you use that mode, it actually so makes it a lot better. It just, I think you have to stand so far, I don't know how far away, it should tell you on the screen if you're too close. I think it's a one seat. <laughs> Do you reckon it's dead center? Oh, it's center, isn't it? <laughs> That's some serious <laughs> optimism. <laughs> So you straight up the person in front of you with your legs, basically. You have to. No, just get shorter. I'm gonna try and get a front on. <laughs> Thank you. 
crazy. Ooh, what the hell? That's mad. That'll be a good one as it's closing. I don't know if I got that. That would have been sick. Damn it, it's out of focus. Oh. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> oh, I might as well. Go on then. Oh, <laughs> oh God, it's electric. That's fake noise. Oh, no. They can't do that. That can't be a thing. They need to stop that now. <laughs> yep, that happened. <laughs> oh yeah, please. I've been waiting all day for you to start that one. <laughs> That's what we come here for. That's a sick shot with a building in the background in the centre of that road. That is oh, fucking that. sick. Yeah, because it's like yeah. dead in line. That's really nice. It's a shame the fucking speed bumps there though. Oh, there is it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I thought I'd be revving all the time. I know. Maybe it's because it's like a, a posh event. I'm surprised if more photographers aren't around here. It's a way better location. You always get the best photos when you don't go where everyone else is. Oh yeah, just drop the gate. Did you just say, oh, we won these tickets, yeah? Um, <laughs> Did you know I'm actually invited here? <laughs> 6,000 pounds. Cheap, I don't know. Trade? Trade, yeah, swap your, you should bring your eco boost down the middle. At least I'm Ooh. Oh, that looks so sick from the back. Oh, yeah. That's a bit of me. That is the shot. That's fucking sick. 
There you go. Koenigsegger gear. It's so strange that the window wiper's in the middle, like, it's a bit, yeah. it's a bit random. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That is a lovely <laughs> front side. Let's see how the doors come out. Up wing doors. Then. I'll open it in a minute. <laughs> it's a bit dirty to be fair. It is actually. That's a bit of a Oh, I don't fucking want to touch it either. Well, it's really dirty. Uh, there's a clear back shot to be fair. Bosh. Bosh. Right, you actually watched till the end of the video. Thank you very much, because <laughs> from my retention on my video, on my uh, YouTube studio thing where you can see like all your analytics, I think it always says that people watch my video for an average of like two minutes and then they click off of it. So thanks for watching to the end. If you did like all the photos, my presets are in the description. That's what I use to edit all those photos. I've had good reviews so far. Everyone seems to like them. I knew they would work because I use them every single day. So it's just a case of if it works, for your style or not, I'll give you some tutorials as well to teach you how I edit, give you some tips. So yeah, if you wanna download them, they're in the description, along with all my gear. And that'll be that. You've made it to the end, so you might as well give me a like, maybe even a little bit of a subscribe if you're feeling spicy. If not, then I can't force you, can I? So <laughs> I'll see you in a bit.